But when he does, he hits hard, man. Like, uh, honestly, like, when they, they spent the night by my place last night, uh, they whenever they played friendlies, it was more more Chalupi taking games off Batamisk, and he was doing it with multiple characters, too. He'd be playing Donkey Kong, Captain Falcon, Ganondorf. Like, he... He switches around the characters, and he's just a very, very solid, like, all-around Smash player. Yep, I played his Ganondorf today and totally got bodied. It's insane, man. Like, I his Ganondorf dittos versus me. Like, I, Ganondorf dittos was something I pride myself in, and this man... Did you win? No, I, I mean, I will, I'll will take games off of him, but, like, if we <laughs> played a set, he'll definitely squeeze it out, because, like, there's there's no way I can beat him. He, he wastes no movement. Yeah. He, he's very, very deliberate with his movement, and, like, he does... He edge guards in a way where, like, he'll, he'll put himself near the edge, and just like threaten with his presence with like certain hitboxes, maybe like the downward angled F tilt or like, you know, D tilt, stuff like that. And then like make you punish high or recover high and then punish you for that too. He's very, very deliberate, but we're getting into it here. First game on a green hill zone. Down throw dash attack, up Ooh. smash. That lingering hitbox, Calum gets it. Chalupi shielding that nair, gets a couple up throws. Nice up throw, up tilt. Ooh, nice. Wow. Uh, perfect L cancel on that Nair. Gets the gentleman. Oof. Charge that down smash. Expecting Calm to go a little bit high. Ooh, recovering high there. See if he's going to get punished for it. And he does. Gets down throw. No DI in that down throw. Calm does not punish. Could not get the up air off in time. Should be messes up his gentleman. Down throw. Missed knee gentleman. Then pulls away. Very, very good. Uh keeping himself from overextending there. Column hit confirming off of his projectile PK freeze, but both oh, nairs wow. were shielded, and we got Captain Falcon Kick into back air. That, that up air, could be the stock. Yeah, there it's going to do it. Chalupi taking the first stock. And it looked like Column was, like, holding over, like, stage control that entire stock, but Chalupi just making his hits count. Yeah, I think Column is having a really hard time adjusting to 3.5 Lucas, actually. Yeah, he... 3.5 Lucas, like, it's pretty much the down throw sends them further away, and your hitboxes, like, aren't as strong, like, in terms of uh, kill potential. Like, for the fair, the back air, uh, I don't think down air was changed too much, but don't quote me. I didn't really read all of his patch notes too intently. I just just glanced and, you know... You looked at all of Gendorf, so obviously. Oh, of course. <laughs> of course. We got up throw, up air. Oh, wow, knee. that was a nice thing. Very nice. No show me your moves, but... Column knows he needs to start so showing some moves. Chalupi. Ooh, tech in place gets punished by that bat. Nice wall jump there, very safe, but unfortunately goes a little bit too high with the up B. Match is reset now, basically. I would have liked to see a uh, wall jump side B or wall jump air dodge back to yeah. the stage, would have been a little bit safer, but. We tied up, tight battle, two stocks apiece. Chalupi's got some momentum right now, getting his double jabs, up throws, knees, nice everything. Knee. Just knows what percentage he can follow up his up throw out of on nice Lucas. Nice use of that platform, too. Yep. Ooh, Colin charging that up smash. Wanted it. Good fair by Colin putting himself behind Chalupi, un preventing himself from getting grabbed, but Chalupi's starting something of his own here. That's a weird sequence on that platform. Yeah, they were both <laughs> uh, trying a bunch of aerials on each other and whiffing. That dash attack, a little unsafe, but Chalupi had his back in the shield, so he cannot punish the shield grab. Ooh. All right, edge guard situation for Column here. Gets the dare, and ooh. Dash grab was in the wrong direction. Was expecting a tech roll to the left, but did not get it, but he's going to get that back air, I'm pretty sure. Not see quite what that was, but it had to have been a back air with that trajectory. Chalupi trying to space in with these nares here. I know Column plays against uh, his roommate Nick, plays Captain Falcon all the time. Nick is also very, very solid, but... Oh, that's gonna wow. be oh, oh, nice meter really, cancel. Really nice meter cancel. Almost got that tech read, but Column starting something of his own now. Gets the dare magnet, but Chalupi, that's, oh, that's it. it. That's, that's it. it. Column knew it. I like. I really like how Column uses his down B for uh, Lucas. I think he utilizes that very well. Yeah, you can use it as a nice combo extender, and uh, it's good. It's actually good, like auto shield pressure too. Like if you. If you've got your, like, if someone's got their back to you or they can't shield grab you, you just put the magnet there and you hold it and you're like, what are you going to do now, boy? <laughs> I, mean, I guess the uh, only option is to uh, buffer roll that, yeah. Yep, yeah, buffer roll. All right, so not too certain on the uh, the new stage placement now. I can't really tell what's banned. 
But Final Destination, I think, would yeah force a character change from Chalupi Ganondorf. That's interesting. I think Donkey Kong might be a better option here, but his his Ganondorf is a pleasure to watch, man. Like I love watching this kid's Ganondorf. Yeah. Especially Ganondorf versus Lucas. Like I feel like there's always something that I can learn. What really surprised me about his Ganondorf was he he was, he was really uh, able to cover a lot of uh, ledge options. Yeah, he's he's against... crazy edge guarding. I don't even know how. Like he just like pushed him, puts himself close to the edge and just like threatens him, threatens all kinds of punishes. Yeah. Downbeat's through that PK freeze. Sees it coming. Mega he's gonna get hit by that one. He's gonna pay for it now too. So Column has landed like at least 10 hits right now. Chulupi sitting at a fat 101%. Chulupi's landed two, Columns at 34. Three hits. It is, it is Ganondorf, though. Yeah. So, Ganondorf really only needs four hits. Like, yeah. Yeah, four hits. That's a stock. And they're dead. Yeah, down throw up smash. The turnaround on the up smash. That is crazy. Chulupi taking that first stock. Nice use of that roll. Gets him with the down beat. Ooh, the spot dodge. I love it. I love Ganondorf's new roll. Yeah, spot the, dodge the new roll awesome. and spot dodge, both so, so dirty. Dash tech up smash, gets him with the offense up, up smash. Still got the charge now, too. Missing that tech read with the flame choke there, and wow, now Chulu is paying nice for it. Up. Yep. And that dare's gonna do it. No tech queued there, and Column taking a stock lead, half stock lead. Adding on to it now, trying to get that full stock lead going. And he gets it. And that oh, back wow. is going to do that it. Ganondorf nice. has no options when he's outside the stage with no jump. I think Column's really feeling it. This yeah, match. Chalupi's wow. DI is a little bit suspect right now. You can see he was DIing in on a few of those uh, initial combo strings, which kept it going for so long. And that's going to be it. Column takes those three stocks in literally under a minute. That was amazing. Yeah, the rain just, like, as soon as that first stock went off, like, just the floodgates opened and... So I don't really know that much about Lucas. I mean, does he excel at stages with no platforms, or? Um, I feel like it's just a player preference kind of thing. Like, yeah. Lucas, like, Gan Ganondorf has a very strong chain grab on Lucas, and we didn't see Chalupi really get many grabs there to, to punish off of. The one that he did get was the down throw turnaround up smash, and that was perfect. It kill killed that stock, but what, what you ideally want to take Lucas to final destination for is to bait out a grab, or bait him into doing some unsafe shield pressure and like getting that grab and then you know, chain throwing him punish yeah. very very hard but okay Gandorf's down throw was nerfed a little bit coming into uh, 3.5 I think that was like the only one of his changes that was negatively affecting him it, the knockback growth goes up a little bit higher quicker so the chain grab is still there on a lot of characters but it'll end a little bit earlier than usual or like the options to DI out of it uh, gotcha. for the opponent come up a little bit quicker but switching back to Captain Falcon here Going back to what worked here in Project M Losers Bracket. This is actually Losers Quarters, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. Cool. Almost got that ledge hop knee, but Calm having none of it. Tosses him right back off stage. Both or both players have traded isolated hits for the most part. No real combo strings yet. 30 seconds into this match, wow. and that was a perfect ledge grab there by Column. Uh, Captain Falcon actually got nerfed a little bit coming into this patch as well. The Raptor boost no longer activates on invincible opponents. You will only get like the little jump if it actually connects, like if it hits. So, as well, we when you're in the air, you mean? Yeah, when. Uh, like what we saw with Column holding onto the ledge there and Chalupi like uh, Raptor boosting into him and just dying, like in 3.2 he would have uh, bounced back onto the stage, but... Ooh. It seemed like that Nair should have uh, gone through the PK freeze, but did not. Chalupi recovering just high enough to get past Column. Yeah, we can definitely see Column has adjusted a lot more in uh, these past couple of games than... Uh, than Chalupi has. Maybe that switch to Ganondorf was not the best option there, but is Captain Falcon not looking as fast and menacing as it was to start? Is that Nair Gentleman going to make an up, up throw? And then Colum replying with an up air of his own. Up air knee? Nope. Oh. Nice tech by Chalupi there. It's probably an L cancel, but you know, you got to give it to him. Ledge hop knee. 
gets shielded, but gets the gentleman out of it, and then Colin gets the dare. Oh, that's fair. Like... That fair definitely would have killed in 3.0, but they, oof, they lowered. Oh, that's too bad. That was very unfortunate for Colin, though. Oh my God, that could be a change in momentum there potentially, but that fair, that sweet spot was made weaker, and the sour spot was made way weaker. So. Getting Nair to dash tags here as he sees Column is DIing the Nairs out. Dash tag is a good follow up there. Gets one hit of that up smash. Chalupi is sitting on a nice lead here after Column's suicide. Column opting to play a little bit more safe. Chalupi finding his feet again. Down throw. <clears throat> oh, almost gets that knee, but Column text in play or text inside. Column really needs to be careful. Oh, oh. yeah. Yeah, that, the range on that tether has is, is definitely been reduced. And Column, you can see he's playing the 3.0 tether length, but... He's SC twice, or he's lost his stock twice, twice because of yep, that Twice, in the now. set. I've seen it twice. Gets that gentleman's. Ooh, barely misses that JC grab, but gets a nair there, and then up throw. Almost gets that back here. Column trying to find a way off this platform. Gets something started there. Gets an F tilt, but Chalupi. Gentleman's right back to into knee, and Ooh, that's, that's going to be the set. Literally the biggest change in momentum wow. was that suicide. 